as you can see, the starboard hand is now becoming more and more planks off. And three already got off the side there. Decks all getting exposed, exposing a rotten beam shelf all the way along as far as the front bulkhead of the aft of the fore deck. It was the outer bulkhead in the main cabin, which is missing. The deck's collapsed because the beam shelf and the beams that are attached to it have not been attached at all. And now this needs all to be removed. New plank, new beam shelf put in, and new deck beams put in. As you can see, I walk along, the, along here, the extent of the damage and the rot. Here is a deck beam that's supposed to be attached to the beam shelf and it's not attached at all. It in fact is rotten. And you go her back towards the back of the boat. No quarter knee connecting the aft deck and the king plank, uh, the beam shelf to the boat. Nor the beam end is not even attached to the boat at the beam shelf at all, it's been cut through as has all the other beams along here see, another one and it's repeated all the way along to the front of the wheelhouse not a very good idea at all hence the reason why the boat has spread apart here and the deck has dropped Hi everybody, Simon back at Chance, starting to take off the uh, beam shelf and some of the deck, hopefully have a bit more chance, be able to see what's wrong with it this time. Good morning, Simon from Let's, Let's Take a Gamble and we've got a chance here. This is our job for today, is to, to remove most of this side deck all the way along here, all the way along there. All the way to the back and if we have time go across it as well to expose the deck beams underneath and remove all this rotten wood here and these missing ends of the deck beams here and then once that's done get on with some more of the planking that needs removing especially this bit here all the way forward until we get to the wheelhouse. So we're gonna have fun. Now this is the whole of the aft deck uncovered from the nape and which has been covered up for years. Bit of a mess. And in this far corner you can see there's been a beam repair but it was never fitted to the side it was never made up to fit the side of the boat that one sort of just about made it but it's only here by the grace of God and the planks on the deck which are on together paint's hanging up her terribly that deck beam is rotten at the end got the end missing and as you can see the tie rod ends is supposed to hold the boat together have been cut off This is a video of the aft cabin from the port side, from the top, as I say, from the, start again, from the toilet compartment going down the port hand side aft towards the transom to the, to the transom to the stern knee. That part of the boat is in its correct position never been messed around with apart from a few planks that have been put on the side other than that this is as it was when it was built however if you go from the stern post in the center of the boat aft and keep going 
round to the forward side of the transom there on the starboard hand side quarter right round to the engineering room which is on the starboard hand side forward end of the master cabin as you can see there's the engineering room with nothing in it at the moment but that is as it is this side has been messed around mercilessly a new beam shelf's been put in not very well and lots of other rubbish has been done to her causing her to leak badly go out of shape and altogether not very good condition at all this is the major part of our work for the next two or three months is to rectify this side of the boat and put it back together again as it's supposed to be and as you can see at this last frame on the starboard hand side it's completely nutly gone it's split broken rotted away as of the planks at the aft end there and there's a track forward where the A bracket was badly rotten ahead of the A bracket gone completely and right up towards the shaft log on the starboard hand side this is all going to have to be removed replaced new mahogany for the planking and a new piece of oak for the stern tube log once we've removed the stern tube out of it this is going to be one major task as there are several bolts that you can see holding this piece of wood in this is just the upper half of the stern tube log there's an equally large piece of wood on the bottom side of the boat which is going to take some removing but that's in the only future at the moment this is what we're doing is removing all the rubbish out of the way in the aft end of the boat so we can get a clear view of what we've got to do over the next two or three months